Hi ladies and gentlemen, welcome to IT Snippets. Today I'm going to show you how to find machines on your network using a program called Angry IP Scanner. So let's get started. The first thing you're going to have to do is go to angryip.org. Once you get there, you can click on free download or on the downloads up here. We'll click on free download and as you can see, there is multiple versions. There's a 32 bit and 64 bit auto detect version for the version of Java that you require for it. And there's one for a 64 bit Java. So I would just click on the 32 bit and 64 bit installer and download that. When you try and install it, it may ask you to get the pre built OpenJDK binaries. So you can get that from adoptopenjdk.net. I chose OpenJDK 11. Just click latest download and install that and Angry IP Scanner like any other Windows application. So I already have it installed in the system, so we can open it up. Uh, it's given me a tip. It wants to send anonymous error reports. That's not going to happen. It's just a little blurb about it. So I can click close, bring this over here. I'll expand it a bit to make it look a bit better for you. Now, if I want to scan for machines on my network, you have to put in the correct start and end IP. So 192.168.0.1 and we're going to go 192.168.0.255. As you can see, it shows my host name and I can choose the network subnet. But for the purposes of this, I'm looking for a new Raspberry Pi that hopefully should be set up in my network. So I'll click start and we'll see what comes back. Okay, one of those alerts kicked in because it won't access to my domain network. So in this case, I'm going to alert it. Okay, it has found 16 alive hosts and eight of them have open ports. And it took 16.92 seconds. So let's just close that just now. If I arrange this via host name, you can see the yeah, Android device. I'm not actually sure what one that is. That may be my mobile phone. Asgard is one of my servers. That's my Mac. You can see my Philips Hue. You can see my Raspberry Pi web server and my Pi Hole. So that is how you would detect what services are running your machine, or rather what machines are on your network, and check the IP of them. And it also shows what port they're actually responding on as well. If you like this video, give it a like. If you dislike this video, give it a dislike too. If you get feedback in this or any other videos or suggestions for videos you believe we should do in the future, then please let us know in the comments below. And most of all, thank you for watching.